Pisces. Hey Pisces, welcome back to my channel. And this is the week ahead reading for the sign of Pisces. If you're new to my channel, I pray before each and every one of my readings so that way my energy is protected, your energy is protected as well. If you're returning, thank you so much for returning and trust me with your energy. So the first message that we have here is we met for a reason. Wow, okay. So what I'm getting clearly with this message is that this is a masculine who just as of recently, something about their energy has shifted, okay? They could have either pulled their energy back. I'm getting something specifically about the communication where they could have rushed in to communicate with you and then pulled their energy back, okay? I'm getting specifically that this was intentional. If your masculine were to be 100% honest with you, they will tell you that there's a lot about your connection that genuinely confuses them. Okay, there's so much that just does not make sense. And as the masculine energy for them, they really, really need it to make sense. This is a very, like this energy is coming across very clear, very concise, like very serious energy coming through with this card here. But for some reason at this current time in your connection, Something has stopped this masculine dead in their tracks and they're determined to make it make sense. And I'm getting that it's something specifically about your energy, Divine Feminine, or the energy of your connection that they are still really, really confused about. So they're currently asking themselves a lot of questions as it pertains to you. But these questions that they're asking I'm getting could be unlocking some very, very powerful activations in your connection. And depending on how energetically bonded you are with this masculine, you may very well be picking up on signs and sinks that are relevant to this process, okay? You may be feeling physical sensations. You may be just feeling a range of emotions where your energy seems to kind of go up and down and it seems as if it's out of your control here. But I'm picking up that your masculine is very curious about this connection, but this is from like a much deeper level. So something in their recent past took place and it has them kind of doing some kind of soul searching. But honestly, I'm getting that their method, one of the methods that they're using to kind of help them get this information is that they're comparing what you have to other connections that they have had in the past here. And what they're realizing is that this one alone stands out by a long shot, okay? Something just feels really, really different. The way that they show up specifically, I'm getting their energy, their process, the way that they process their emotions, the way that they express themselves, the way that they feel is very, very different than they have ever felt in any other connection. Okay, but for some reason, this information um, that they're seeking is very, very important. I don't know if this is a deciding factor. I don't know if this has anything to do with the trajectory of your connection here, but they felt this for a very, very long time. Okay, and I'm getting that at this stage of your connection, it's very important for them to get the answers, okay, about you. They're very curious about your energy but they're trying to gauge what this means from a from a higher perspective okay um and i'm getting magnetic okay so that could be the thing that's sticking out to them divine feminine is the magnetic pull that they feel towards you that they've never felt before here so i'm getting that you may be a feminine who's really really tapped into your energy and you have this natural ability to just draw things to you, whether you know this or not, okay? And I'm also getting that the one thing that this masculine is trying to decode, the one thing that's kind of driving them crazy is the very thing that drew them to you in the first place. It's everything about you that they can't see. It's your essence, okay? And this is just really driving them crazy, okay? I'm getting that... This is what really pulled on them the most. It's your energy, okay? I'm getting that even though you may be very beautiful, you may be very attractive here, um, something about them, it's something 
about them wanting to see you from a higher perspective, okay? It's almost as if they're being asked to look at this from a higher perspective, right? Because honestly, if they were to just be completely honest with you, because I definitely feel like this energy may show up in your connection as them being hot and cold, okay? As, you know, things being very, very intense one minute and then you questioning everything. And this is because they have this general underlying energy of confusion, okay? And this very well may be spilling over into your connection. But honestly, to them, it doesn't make sense like none of it, okay? They're still shocked about how this came together. They're still shocked about why they feel so intensely about you as they do here, okay? But the one thing that's sticking out to them, the one thing that they are sure about is that this was not by accident. That's, that's the only thing that they know. Everything else is a total mystery to them, okay? So wow. They really have a general curiosity about your connection at this time right now, okay? And you definitely may be picking up on this energy as well, Divine Feminine. Um, there just could be this air of, you know, kind of confusion. There could be kind of stuck energy. You could be really looking at your masculine, trying to figure out their moves, figure out what it is that they're doing. Because I'm feeling like if they did pull their energy back, I'm getting specifically there was a masculine who either pulled back their energy. Um, maybe you're not communicating as much as you used to here. This was definitely intentional. And this was solely for the purpose of them trying to make this make sense. This information is extremely important to them at this stage. Um, yeah, they're, they're, not, they're not budging on this at all. Okay, I'm also picking up that this is a very practical masculine energy. Their energy is coming through very firm, okay? This is someone who values facts over feelings. They don't just give their heart to anyone. They don't trust people easily. They don't just fall in love easily. So something about your connection kind of makes them feel a little bit off kilter here. Maybe they fell for you a little bit too quickly. They're trying to kind of catch their footing here. Um, but something about your energy has them a little bit over edge and they're really trying to make it make sense, okay? Let's get the next message here. Wow. The next message we have is, you're my one true love. Wow. Okay, so I'm getting that for some of you. That may just serve as confirmation right there. You were really genuinely wondering how this masculine felt about you. You feel the intensity. You feel, you know, all the feels. But you really wanted to know if this masculine was in love with you. This is how they feel about you, okay? And this is why they're trying to make sense of your connection because they, they're in love with you. Okay, or they think that they're in love with you. And I'm getting that a method that they're using to determine this is that they're using the other connections that they've had as proof that they are actually in love with you. This may sound very, very silly, okay? But for some reason, this, this is sticking out. This connection is sticking out like a sore thumb. And the fact that all of the their other connections don't compare to this one is what's really making them kind of zero in on this, okay? But I'm getting that specifically, the way that they feel about you causes them to act out of the ordinary or causes them to kind of overthink a lot of their actions. And this is not normal for them. This is completely out of the norm for this masculine. This is somebody who is very very you know straight up and down very poised okay who handles business but when it comes to you and your energy divine feminine you kind of throw them out of whack a little bit okay this masculine i'm picking up may even try to hold back in either their action or their communication because of this because you know your energy or how they feel causes them to act a little bit out of the ordinary right and I'm sure you know how they feel about you, but you may not have an idea of just how intense their emotions are for you. Also, the thing that's sticking out here is that this masculine knew who you were before you knew who they were. And I'm getting that this is 
simply off of your energy alone, okay? You had the ability to kind of pull on this masculine. You had the ability to garner their attention and to keep their attention, okay? Something about you stood out to them. And I'm getting that. Some of you may have needed a confirmation about this. This, this is your confirmation. I keep getting the word confirmation. Okay, there is, honestly, there's a lot of information that's coming through with this message. Um, so I feel like they have either repressed a great deal or, or they're, they're practicing a, a great deal of constraint when it comes to you here, okay? I'm getting that the attraction was so intense that they actually didn't know if this was love or lust. Because this feminine energy that I'm tapping into I'm getting that you have very seductive energy as well. You're able to easily draw in masculine energy just from your natural essence. It's like you don't even have to do anything in particular. You don't have to try hard. You just kind of ooze this seductive kind of energy. And I'm getting that this masculine knows that about you. And this is a quality that they know that you possess. So they may be, maybe they were a little bit cautious in how they engaged you initially. Maybe they even vowed that this wasn't going to go past a certain point, okay? They weren't going to fall in love, but they did. And they're confused about it, okay? They're questioning themselves at this point. But I'm getting that there's something underneath your exterior that's extremely mysterious, but also pure. And it makes this masculine want to know more about you. It made them want to know more about you. So I'm getting a divine feminine, okay? You may be a little bit apprehensive and you aren't sure if your masculine actually feels this way, if they actually love you, okay? And honestly, I've seen in, in many cases where the masculine actually identifies the divine feminine first, okay? It's their nature to respond to the feminine energy. Their entire being responds to their divine feminine. And there's really no way that they don't feel it. Like imagine them being in a room, in the same room with the divine feminine, a person who was created just for them and, and them not knowing it. They absolutely know this, okay? They may not have the words simply because it doesn't make sense and they need it to make sense badly, okay? But this masculine is absolutely in love with you. And as silly as this may sound, they are actually using past relationships as a measuring stick. And this connection is just off the charts in every single category. The chemistry, the attraction, the passion, okay? Emotionally, energetically, on every single level here, okay? I'm also getting that this this is a lot of energy like this masculine has been holding this back, okay? So I feel like this may be something that they haven't verbalized to you because there's so much information coming through with this card, you're my one true love, okay? They may just be coming to this conclusion, okay? Um there's so much energy coming, so much information coming through with this. But I'm also getting that you have a lot in common as it pertains to your love journey and the lessons that you both have gathered, you know, along the way. I'm getting something about this connection is the total opposite of any connection that you've ever been in here. And you may not have openly discussed this. You may not have openly discussed your past, but I'm getting there's a deep, deep resonance there. And for every reason, for, for whatever reason, this is being highlighted for your person. They're focused on this, right? But they're focused on their relationships as if, as if it's something about their personal journey that they would like to share with you or give you a little bit more insight about as it pertains to their past here. So I don't know if you've ever, you know, spoken about your past before, but this masculine really, really is hyper-focused on their relationships, right? And I'm getting that this is a masculine that's kind of been through, they, they've been through their fair share of low vibrational connections, as well as relationships that, that has served them well. But the thing that's sticking out here is the fact that they've always kind of felt this deep emptiness. They didn't feel balance in these connections. I'm getting something about masculine and feminine energy here and, and it being a, an imbalance. But for some reason, that's what they're focused on. 
and they're analyzing specifically how they showed up in these connections versus how they show up and how they feel in this connection with you with a close attention to their emotional process. And honestly, I feel like because Divine Feminine, you exude this powerful feminine energy, like they naturally have to assume this powerful masculine energy, but something about the dynamic is sticking out with your person and how this, this relates to you in some kind of way. But your energy, you have this naturally uh, this natural ability to balance this masculine. And they also feel that you can handle their energy. Yeah, emotionally, mentally, sexually, like they feel like you can handle them, like you are their perfect match. Yeah. But yeah, I'm getting that there, there's like a very clear and concise energy coming through. As if they know for sure that what you have is clearly what love is, okay? What true love is. And where they stand right now on their journey, they have like a deep respect for everything that they've been through, all of their experiences prior to this, because they feel like it kind of led them to you in the first place, okay? Yeah, they can actually see themselves with you for a lifetime. And I'm getting that it's your energy specifically that keeps sticking out here, the way that you make them feel, okay? I'm not sure if this, if this was something that they felt was lacking in their previous connections here, but they just feel like you get them. Like things that may have been a little bit difficult, it just comes really easy with your dynamic, okay? So much so that they even ask themselves if, if this connection is too good to be true. This is something that you may ask yourselves as well, Divine Feminine. I'm also getting that this is like a heart-to-heart -heart kind of moment, okay? Like, I don't know if you've had these kind of conversations with this masculine here, but they definitely have been through some things on their journey. And something is sticking out about some type of like acceptance or you just really being able to see the parts of them something about loving them intuitively as well here it's like you're so empathic that you just know what it is that they need okay and that's very very important to them they love that quality about you so the next message we have is you're a blessing in disguise okay so what I'm actually getting is that this is a major realization that this masculine came to find out as they were in separation from you, okay? I'm getting that this was hidden from them or they feel as if this was hidden from them, but I'm also getting perfect, perfect timing. So the timing of this information, the timing of what it is that they found out about you um, is actually perfect. And it was actually like it was imperative for them to find out at a certain time because had they found this out sooner, maybe they would have had an adverse reaction to this. Maybe things went, wouldn't have went along as smoothly here. But I'm getting that this masculine had bits and pieces of information about you be known to them, okay? Or make itself known at very different stages of your connection. And I honestly feel like it was meant for it to be this way, okay? So they may have actually started out, there's a vast difference on how they started out in this connection versus to how they are now, specifically how they view you in the beginning, right? But right now, everything is coming together. Maybe in the beginning, they had no idea how this will all unfold. Maybe they didn't have any expectations at all because I'm getting that this happened gradually and then something happened and it was just like, boom, they just went through like a major realization about you here. And I'm getting that specifically, it's the way that you engage this masculine, okay? That makes them face themselves instead of projecting things onto you. I'm getting that something could have happened in the recent past where you made them stand face to face with themselves to find out why they actually do the things that they do. And at first, they, they were not very happy about this, okay? They may have been really, really triggered about this, but I'm getting that it triggered them in the best way possible. I'm picking up on the divine feminine energy that is very expressive, okay? 
and you have a way of communicating that really makes this masculine think, right? And this may also be what stands out about you is that you're not afraid to challenge them and they really love this about you. You are not the least bit intimidated by their energy at all, okay? And they know that you're not the type of feminine that's gonna let things slide, especially when they have to do with things that directly affect your general well-being, okay? And it's like Divine Feminine, you're at this place where you know that anything that's going to be attached to you or anything that you're gonna be pouring your energy into, it has to be positive, okay? You're very intentional about that. And I definitely feel like when you were met with moments of tension in this connection here, or when your masculine could have been operating in a lower vibrational energy, you're definitely someone who would be vocal about this, okay? You know, you challenge them in this way. They know that you're not a pushover, and I'm getting that, I'm getting this very clearly. They love this about you, even if they have not expressed this to you, okay? So there very well may have been something that you said that actually made them go inward. So like I was saying earlier, this time away that they're taking, if they have pulled their energy back, this is intentional, okay? Um, they pulled their energy back to look deep within themselves and what they found was actually very, very shocking. So whatever you said to them, you help them to look inside and identify some barriers or some type of patterns here, but something about their relationships are popping up here so you help them to identify some type of pattern and had you not been yourself had you not been standing firmly in your authenticity they would have never um they would have never came to this realization okay and this energy probably would have spilled over into what you were trying to build with your person okay they probably have not said this to you but they actually thank you for being yourself, for being vocal, okay? For being very expressive in how it is that you feel. So they feel as if just being connected with you, they feel as if they are becoming a better version of themselves. And this goes back to that energy thing, the balance of the masculine and feminine energy. You have a very subtle way of doing this, of, of getting your point across that blows their mind, okay? because they actually listen to you and they value your insight. And they see you as someone that they can have a very promising future with, okay? Um, I'm getting also specifically that they say certain things just to hear how you'll interpret the information and you shock them every single time. So your energy divine feminine is something like they, they've never experienced before here. And if you're wondering how they currently are viewing you, they're viewing you as a blessing in disguise because they feel as if they've gotten way more value from this connection than they have expected, okay? I'm getting that you may be a feminine energy that gets judged by your outer appearance. There's something about you and this masculine dynamic, okay? Um, but when people get to know you, they actually begin to view you totally different, okay? You're someone here who is very, very observant as well. I'm getting you pay close attention to this masculine energy and they have verbal as well as nonverbal cues that let you know exactly what it is that they're feeling and exactly where they are on their journey as well. So it's almost as if the questions that you ask them or the things that you talk about, it blows their mind, okay? So yeah, I definitely feel like there were bits and pieces of information that they received, okay, that were revealed to this masculine about you or this connection. And they're currently viewing you as a blessing in disguise because they're realizing that this, this info about you was never really hidden, okay? They just became more aware of who you were as they opened themselves up to you more and, and to this connection, okay? But wow, they're, they're like in shock right now. Let's get the next card here. Wow, the next card we have is, you're a part of my destiny. Wow, that's double confirmation there. This, this masculine is absolutely in love, okay? 
And I feel like they're doing some researching. Okay, they could be speaking to people in confidence. Um, they are in shock, okay? And I feel like their emotional process, their, their inner compass is kind of driving them to, to come to these conclusions here. This could be because they could be planning something for the future, okay? But the one thing that they're sure of is that you are a part of their destiny. This masculine may actually be aware that this is a twin flame connection, okay? Because although you identify with this divine feminine, I definitely feel like one of your biggest concerns or the questions that you ask yourself is does this masculine identify this connection with such with, with, with this powerful energy, okay? But they feel like you are a part of their destiny in some kind of way. And this connection is, is so intense, it's so cyclic, but there's an element to it that's also so otherworldly. And your masculine knows this. And for some reason, this information is rushing in at this moment. So maybe they were not ready for this level of information in the past. Maybe they would not have understood it, okay? But for some reason, they know now and they want you to know that they know, okay? So however they identify with this connection, they're literally aligning it with such a powerful energy. And I feel like this will have a very positive effect on the connection, even if you're at a distance from your person, just having just them having this level of awareness is enough to infuse the connection with new energy and kind of relieve the pressure off the connection at the at, at this moment okay and i also feel like the masculine is at ease knowing this information knowing that you're not just someone that they can't get out of their head or someone that they're obsessing over they know that this connection means something and i feel like they are truly at peace with this like i just feel a really peaceful calm energy at this time right now and i also feel like divine feminine you can find peace knowing that you're not alone and that this masculine is aware that you have this sacred bond okay so yeah i feel like that definitely takes a little stress off of the connection okay but yeah that's very powerful i definitely feel like um they're trying to figure out exactly what it is that this means okay but they've come to the conclusion that you're kind of bonded for life, okay? They can't get you out of their system, right? And their thoughts may very well be all over the place. I feel like they're receiving such a rush of information at this time, and they don't know how to process everything, okay? But, so, but the most important thing is that they know that the way they're feeling about you is for a reason. A lot of their internal nudges, intuitive nudges as well, have been confirmed, okay? Let's get the next message here. Wow. Yeah, it's just confirmation after confirmation. We have, you were sent to me. Wow. Yeah. They're realizing that you were sent to them at the perfect time, Divine Feminine. And they're really happy about the timing here. I'm getting that, that they would not have been prepared for this if it were to have happened sooner. So this is the conclusion that they've come to about you. You were sent to them, okay? They may re they were really trying to figure out where you came from, why you were making them feel all these things that they never felt before. And I feel like they definitely pulled back their energy to kind of regroup a little bit. But they definitely went deep in the archives, okay? They've been looking through their old relationships, their past relationships, their dynamics, their patterns here. They were really, really serious about this making sense. And I'm definitely getting this energy of them wanting to move this connection forward in a more serious, there may be, there may be a higher commitment coming, okay? But I definitely feel like this process that they went through was very, very important to them because this masculine does not open their heart for anyone, okay? Of course, they've been in relationships before, they've been in love, but to let them let themselves fully fall in love and to let go, okay, may be just a bit challenging for them. So I definitely feel like all of this research and all of this, you know, this probing and asking questions, all of this is not in vain, okay? They're doing this for a reason, for a 
bigger reason. I definitely feel like there's something brewing, okay? You may definitely feel this level of anticipation happening at this time, okay? And this is because they're definitely building momentum. Wow. Yeah, I'm getting this connection with you definitely open their eyes and they can see clearly right now. And I'm getting that this is mainly because they can be themselves, okay? They can really be themselves. And they really view you as a total blessing in disguise because there's something about your energy that made this masculine feel as if they are like, like they are a complete match like you are their complete match okay something about this is extremely natural you may just be very very compatible but you're a feminine energy that they really really inspire i'm talking in a powerful feminine energy here that naturally makes this masculine just assume you know his natural position here and that's like very powerful energy coming through here yeah your energy meshes very, very well with theirs. So if they haven't told you this already, okay, all of this, you're their, their, their true love, you're a part of their destiny, I definitely feel like they will be letting you know very, very soon. For a lot of these masculines, they have pulled their energy back, and this is for that reason, okay, for them to make sense of everything that's going on here. Let's get the last message. We have, I don't want to screw this up. They're definitely planning something, okay? <laughs> They're definitely planning something, but it's almost as if now that they've stepped into this major confirmation, this has been confirmed for them, okay? I definitely feel also I just got guidance, okay? They may be seeking divine guidance about how to navigate this connection forward because they, they're being very meticulous, okay? It's almost as if now that something about your energy has been confirmed for them, they're being, they're being very particular in how they move forward, okay? Wanting to be very cautious, wanting to make sure they don't misstep, okay? But I'm definitely getting that by them praying or by them consciously creating momentum in the spiritual realm, this along with whatever, whatever you have going on, Divine Feminine, this is really accelerating the process at this time, okay? And I know I say this a lot, but things definitely have to manifest in the spiritual realm or the 5D before they manifest in the 3D. So, yeah, this masculine is definitely acknowledging that they know who you are right now, okay? And I feel like there's going to be a huge shift. And this is simply because they have made a change or they've realized it's kind of like they've course corrected here. You pointed something out to them, Divine Feminine, something that made them go in and deeply reflect who they were, how they were showing up. They, they're even comparing their past relationships, everything, trying to get this right, trying to move forward and navigate this right. They're completely thankful to you. They view you as a blessing in disguise because they were confused about this connection, okay? They didn't know if they were in love with you, if there was if there was this powerful lust energy because it was just so intense, okay? So intense in a way that they have never felt before. But now they're viewing you as a blessing in disguise because the more that they got to peel back the layers and get to know you, you actually were their mirror, you actually made them look at themselves and identify. You probably were the first person who ever did this. You challenged them, okay? <laughs> You're not afraid of, of, of their energy at all. They view you as a total match. This is powerful masculine energy coming through, aligning with powerful feminine energy, okay? This is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful. So I'm going to go ahead and stop the reading here. If you resonated with this message, please be sure to hit the like button on your way out. If you haven't already, please be sure to subscribe to the channel. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye.